Okay, I'll do a video on Jessica X. I don't do a video on her every move, just the same as I don't do a video on Kevin Samuels every move. But anyway, on her last video, um, she still didn't show any proof, in my opinion, because anyone could pretend to be Jessica X. Anyone. We don't know who's behind the screen. It could be a new person every day. <laughs> We don't, because it's just a voice. Anyone can mimic a voice. Like, how dumb do you have to be to be tricked by a voice? It could be someone else on Jessica X's line, and she just went on the other screen. Maybe she couldn't get anyone to pr pretend to be her the other day. Maybe that person was working. It was random for her, maybe, because she only did it a couple hours later. She had a few days to plot and plan, so she has had time. You know, I just want to see what Chris Logic has to say on Monday. I want to see the video, <clears throat> and I'm going to probably respond to that. But I don't really... I think what she did proves anything, which is probably a major reason why when I saw the video, I didn't even watch long. Uh, you know, I don't know. Jessica makes me a little bored, and her videos are a little long. And I've said this before, that this is a major reason why you can't pay attention to everything she's saying, because... She's got like five hour long lives sometimes, and sometimes her lives are two hours. But what if the topics at hand aren't things you care about? Like the first time I ever talked to Jessica X, if anyone wants to look at the video March 11th, I think it was, or something like that. Um, and I was talking to her on that other guy's platform, 2020. Um, you can see, I don't talk much in that whole conversation among them, because it wasn't very interesting to me. The only point I had in talking to her was on colorism. You know, see, those are the things I focus more on, and I understand some of the things she says on colorism is right on, and I agree with, you know. But if it's laced in... A lot of different things that are boring to me, it's hard to even try and pick through it. It's kind of like this other chick who just basically shows us her everyday life situations and experiences. I know some people like her. What's her name? Kelly Stamps. Yeah, that chick. People will like her videos, but I find them very boring. You know, Jessica X is like that to me, where it's just very boring. And then maybe there's something I'm supposed to watch because someone told me to. And I get a bit annoyed because it's like I had to get through all that boring stuff to get to the main part. That's why this time I just skipped, you know. But yeah, I don't think she proved anything. Basically, I don't. Um, she didn't show herself and that other person to show she is a different person than that person. She didn't do that. All she did was hide behind a screen, and we don't know who was behind the screen. So it could be someone who's faking her voice so she can go on the other side of that camera and show that that's her. And she's a different person than the person who's faking her voice. Um, so, I mean, th that was obvious. I don't understand why anyone would not come to that conclusion. Or maybe you're so simple-minded, your brain just never went that way. I don't know, you know. Not to attack you, you know. I don't really have anything against you like that. But, yeah, that's just my take on it. You ask for it, there you go. Have a great day. Like and subscribe, guys. Bye. And I will do another live on this, like I said after Chris Logics. So, have a great day guys. Bye.